I've said it before, it doesn't matter what's happening in Magic Land. A team that no matter how bad they are always gives us trouble. The Magic will show up to beat up the Timberwolves. Cole Anthony gonna turn into Ja Morant. Mo Wagner gonna turn into the Duke version of Christian Leitner. Bull Bull turns into Bull Bull. And then tonight, a special edition, Mo Bamba turns into Muhammad Ali and starts fighting Austin Rivers while he's not even in the game. He starts throwing punches and they're in a confrontation. What happens when two players do something wrong? Five total players get ejected from the game. That should have just been Rivers and Mo Bamba out of there. Makes sense. A couple players do extremely normal things, all get ejected. Jalen Suggs, Jaden McDaniels, and Torian Prince being the extra three that were unnecessary. And that was a catastrophic thing to happen to the Timberwolves because the Magic had a lot of people going tonight. Their bench was balling. They had three players in double digits on their bench in the first half alone. Meanwhile, the Timberwolves really struggled. Kyle Anderson only got five minutes of play. So addition to Jordan McLaughlin, Carl Anthony Towns already being out to start the game, Kyle Anderson goes out, and then our other two main forwards and wings get ejected in Jay McDaniels, Torian Prince. And every guard on the roster was terrible tonight, even though D'Lo would have some of his Fourth quarter heroics where he's making shots, still playing poorly, but covering up with his stat line by just draining difficult shot after difficult shot in the fourth. He's in such a hot shooting stretch, but has just been playing some bad basketball lately. Six turnovers in this game, had five in the first half, extremely sloppy and careless. Anthony Edwards was giving you just about the same thing. Multiple plays in the second half where he got backcourt violations, and he just kind of quit and didn't really try to save them or go after them. By the way, to support how bad our guards were, they shot 15 of 44 combined tonight. Pretty miraculous that game was even close. Big part probably being Paulo Bancaro. Uh, maybe the Magic's best player, 3 of 16 tonight, couldn't do much. But the Wolves were extremely sloppy, we lost players, and we didn't utilize probably the two best people today that played. With. Gobert had a really good game, like he was impactful in a lot of his minutes, still never really locked down his defensive matchup, like Mo was getting a lot of buckets on him. Well, I guess you can say either one there, Bamba or Wagner, but I was kind of referring to Wagner. But I thought Gobert was playing a really solid game, Nas gave us some good stretches, and then we barely played them whatsoever in the second half. Really, really sloppy, bizarre game in general, and that's just, it's what the magic do to us. They have this magic power to give us the biggest nut punches of losses every year! Some parting stats on how much the Magic have brutalized the Timberwolves lately. They've won 21 of their last 29 matchups against the Timberwolves and have won their last 11 of 16 in Target Center.